Two very important things happened this Thursday. First being, the Lego Movie came out, which I haven't seen yet, so I'm not gonna talk about that. But the other thing, it's the Winter Olympics! And I love the Winter Olympics. I love the Winter Olympics so much. I think I have enough puns to start making this video. Now I know what some of you may say. Bunch of people playing in the snow? Bored! That was the first pun. Pun count. And to those people I say, You've probably never seen the Winter Olympics before. Honestly, it's one of the coolest things that's ever existed. And space exists. Space is pretty cool. What could be cooler than a bunch of athletes from around the world rush into the Olympics? The Olympics create a world unity in good sportsmanship and competition, and it's just so lovely. I love how friendly all the athletes are to each other. And then the fantastic opening ceremonies. Oh man, Russia was really putting on a really good show. Curling is really sweeping the nation. This isn't a curling brush, it's something for the carpet, but it's basically a curling brush. Makes ice slippier. If you think curling is weird or boring, you're wrong. Honestly, after watching a couple rounds already, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna grow up and be a curling commentator one year. Now, I know that a curling match takes about four hours to complete, but if you can, go onto the NBC website with all the Olympic events and go to Sweden vs. Great Britain and find round eight, because they, Sweden, killed. It's actually exciting to watch that round. Sweden really rocked the house. The the things and curlings are called rocks or stones, and then the, the target is called the house. <sighs> there are also a lot of cute snowboarding Olympian girls, but I can't marry any of them because I can't afford five rings. I can't believe I have to wait until Thursday for hockey. <sighs> what the puck? Biathlon was on? Shoot, I missed it. She doesn't do ice skating pairs because she prefers isolation. Isolation. The kingdom of isolation. And I guess I'm the queen. Isolation. <laughs> Let it go. Let it go. Man, don't know any of these words. Let it go. There's no way I would ever do cross country. Just watching that makes my thighs burn. When I go to the Olympics next time it's held in four years and who knows where, I'm gonna do alpine skiing or super G or slalom or super combined or giant slalom. Oh, ski cross. I haven't even thought about that in too long. Oh. I love ski cross and snowboard cross. Oh, I want to do everything in the Olympics and I want to watch everything in the Olympics. Oh my god. Why does that man over there have no bones? Because he does luge, not skeleton. I don't know that much about bobsledding. Should I call it Robert sledding until I get to know it better? Wow, I didn't know you were that good at skating. <laughs> Go figure. Speed skating's pretty intense though, and it's always really great when everybody crashes, like that one time that Australia won a gold medal. You should look that up, and it's on my Tumblr somewhere, and <laughs> it's fantastic. It's happening. Man, the judges on moguls are really strict. I don't even know what they call it, freestyle. And the last one I wrote down was Sean White and the Seven Boards. And I don't have anything else to say about that. <laughs> Let me remind myself how to speak. Do the rains in Spain collect mainly on the plain? Plains. Two very important things makes ice slippier or er, slip slippier 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 <laughs> I'm an idiot and the judges on free no, 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 moguls moguls the, ju 